M0 FXB, welcome to my channel. So I had a message from a friend saying that he could not download the CSV file from the Wireless Institute of Australia. So I've tried this and I've downloaded this file, which you get here. Click here and then you get the normal looking CSV file. And I've had a quick look at the PDF as well that comes with this, uh, of everything that's in it. And as far as I can see, unless I'm wrong, this PDF, this CSV file is more for DMR, for a DMR radio, because I have actually tried to install it on my 52 and my 705, and he, he's on an ICOM 705. So the best place to come to do this is actually here. So I'm gonna put the link in the description, and this, this video is for the ICOM 705, really all the 52 but let's do the 705 so what I would do is up here I would put Australia Australia like so look up location and you can be more accurate you don't have to be the whole of Australia and then I would change here to the radio and I've tested this it works I've got the E version radio you may have the A version if you're in the USA I've got the E version then we click download we've got our CSV file there okay and I've already put one in a file so next thing is let's get our ICOM 705 so we'll just get that so it's a bit more prominent so you can see it like so and we're going to turn it around and take out the SD card so the first thing we're going to do is turn the radio off so I'll just uh, do that now turn it off power off then we'll turn it round and we will find the, uh, the connector here. I'll just see if I can get to it. It is quite fiddly, but you pull the flap down and then you push. And you hear a click. Now you've got to be really careful putting these in and taking these out because they can actually get trapped in the wrong place. So I've got some tweezers here. I'm just going to pull it out. Like so, and it comes out. Try not to get sharp ones, you don't want to scratch your radio, and it comes out basically like that, okay? Gold bit facing forward. So we'll get that into our SD card adapter. Right, we've got it into our SD card adapter, now let's have a look on the PC. So back at the PC, go plug your SD card in, in of course and then go to your USB drive and you're going to see this show up here ICOM 705 system information so double click AC705 now I've already put these in here so I'm going to show you how I did that I literally just went to files where I'd saved those those CSV files as you can see here and I just literally dragged them across now it's probably easier just to drag them where you need them. So go to, let's have a look here, CSV. So I can get this bit bigger. And then go to repeater list. And then drag them in like that. Runk, we've already got them, so. Drag them in. I've dragged both the Australian one in which didn't work, and the one that did work, which is the IRNEI, that came from the dstar.org site. And then we'll go back, now they're in there, look, if you go back out, they're in the repeater list file, now directory, should we call it? We'll go back to the radio. Okay, so we've got it, I'm gonna put it back in. So like I said, it's a bit fiddly. You've gotta be really careful, you don't, lose it in the radio so make sure it slides in nice and easy well I'm trying to do this on camera I don't think I can I'll just pause it a minute so let's turn it on like so not the clearest picture a bit glary here isn't it anyway let's get it on Let's go to menu, set, SD card, and then we're going to go load setting. 
No, we don't want load setting, we want import, import, then import again. See if I can dim this down so it's not so glaring. Okay. Like so, and then we're going to go, uh, not at CSV, we're going to go import, and then we're going to go repeater list. And it says no file, <laughs> that's cool. Let's go down, oh, repeater list. There are, there, there's, now can you see that I put both the files in, but the only one that's showing up is the one that's from the DSTAR website. So you do need a DSTAR file to make this work, so we might as well import it. Um, Keep skip settings in the repeater list. So they must have ones where it skips. I'm just going to go no. So I'll import file, yes. And then it imports. And that's the latest repeater list for the UK. And we have to restart. There you go. And remember, a repeater list on a D star radio isn't the same as on a DMR radio. It's a, it's a different structure, I would say. You've seen the way when you use DR mode. It's firing up now. Let's go into DR mode. Hold down here for DR mode. And we're in DR mode. You can see all these different repeaters around the world. If we tap, um, let's, let's go back. Yeah, repeater list. And you can look, you know, and one of them is Australia. There's your Australian one there. So, what I'll say is, um, sorry I'm away from the mic, is if you use the repeater list from the WIA, yeah, I can find that again. So, um, WIA, there you go. I would say that, and correct me if I'm wrong, it's for the DMR radio, and that's why it doesn't work. But if you want to get the latest repeaters, just go to the D star info page here i'll put the link in the description put australia in then click download and then you're gonna have everything you need on the icon 705 the 52 and basically all of these different models of icon radios d star so i hope this helps you 73 thanks for watching my channel catch you on air all the best